Hello friends, uh, today I will discuss about backup over current relay setting for transformer in coordination with distribution feeder. Here a distribution substation is shown, uh, that is uh, the 33 kb bus has been shown here and it is 11 kb bus. In between 33 kb bus and 11 kb bus there exists a transformer of capacity 10 mb and percentage of impedance is 8.5 percent. Now HP side CT ratio is 400 by 1 and LB side CT ratio is 600 by 1. Now uh, from 11 kb bus uh, there uh, exist two feeders, feeder 1, feeder 2 and CT ratio is 400 by 1 each. Now relay is connected from secondary of the CT for feeder and also for transformer LB and HB. Now if external fault occur, that is either fault occur in feeder 1 and feeder 2 if uh, overcurrent relay uh, connected with the CT secondary fail to clear the fault uh, due to any reason then only as a backup of this protection uh, the relay connected uh, with this CT secondary that is um, 600 by 1 secondary shall operate to clear the fault and that is why it is called the LV backup overcurrent relay and if uh, this relay connected uh, this relay failed to clear the fault then only the HB over current uh, relay uh, shall operate to clear the uh, fault and that is why it is called HB backup over current relay. So in this video I will discuss about uh, LP and HB over current relay setting coordination in connection with the feeder. Uh, relay setting. Now, since a 10 MBA transformer is connected in between 33 by 11 kV bus and percentage impedance is 8.5 percent, considering uh, the infinite source or zero impedance at uh, 33 kV um, bus, uh, the maximum fault current at 11 kV bus. Uh, I fault uh, shall be equal to 1 by z per unit that is percentage impedance of the uh, transformer uh, which is uh, 1 by 0 0.085 per unit uh, which is equal to a 11.765 per unit. Now at 11 kV side the full load current is uh, 525 ampere uh, and therefore the for maximum fault current will be 525 into uh, 11.765 which is equal to 6.176 ampere or 6.176 kilo ampere. By considering uh, maximum um, fault current at 11 kV bus, uh, we shall coordinate uh, the uh, uh, setting of uh, feeder in connection with the LV uh, over current and HV over current uh, relay setting. Now, first uh, we choose the uh, setting for 11 kV feeder. Uh, let us consider the pickup uh, for 11 kV feeder as a uh, 1 ampere, that is uh, current set uh, for over current relay, and TMS, that is time multiplier setting, as 0 0.05 second for IDMT IEC standard inverse curve. Now, as per IEC uh, standard inverse curve, the trip time T is given by T equal to 0 0.14 into TMS divided by PSM to the power 0 0.02 minus 1. Now PSM is uh, uh, defined as the ratio of the fault current to the setting current. Now here the fault current is the max considering the maximum uh, fault current at 11 kb bus. That is fault occur very close to 11 kb bus and this fault current is sensed by this uh, CT. So, the fault current is, uh, if uh, fault current uh, occur very close to 11 kV bus, then maximum, considering the maximum fault current, that is uh, 6176 ampere, uh, the secondary uh, reflection of this uh, fault current uh, is 6176 divided by 400. Uh, so, the PSM value is given by 6176 divided by 400 divided by 1, I said is uh, 1 ampere. That is the secondary uh, value of the setting. So the PSM comes as 15.44. Uh, 
Now the trip time is given by as per IDMT uh, IEC standard inverse curve equal to 0.14 into 0 0.05 0 0.05 set as the TMS uh, divided by 15.44 to the power 0 0.02 minus 1 which comes as 0 0.14 into 0 0.05 divided by 1.056 minus 1. So uh, this trip time values comes as 0 0.125 second that is 125 millisecond. Now considering this trip time we will uh, set uh, or coordinate uh, the LV over current relay setting and also HV over current relay setting. Now as the trip time for 400 uh, for 11 kV feeder is uh, 0 0.125 second or 125 millisecond uh, we shall give the trip time for LV uh, over current delay a slight uh, uh, 100 to 150 millisecond margin so trip time is set as uh, uh, taking as a uh, 150 millisecond margin that is a uh, 0.275 second now uh, for uh, LV over current feeder the setting I set is given by the uh, certain percentage of full load current the full, full load current for 11 kV side is 525 ampere so the I set is uh, equal to 110 percent of 525 ampere that is comes as 578 ampere so in secondary value the setting for LV over current relay is 578 divided by 600 as the CT ratio is 600 by 1 which is as 0.96 ampere. Now PSM is given by IF by IS that is fault current by I set. Now fault current is uh, 6, uh, 6176 ampere and the I set is 578 ampere. So the value of the PSM comes as 10.69 ampere. Now I will calculate uh, the value of TMS so that the tip time comes as uh, within uh, 275 millisecond so 0.275 equal to 0.14 into TMS uh, divided by PSM to the power 0 0.02 now PSM is 10.69 to the power 0 0.02 minus 1 so the uh, value comes as 0 0.14 into point, uh, TMS divided by 1.05 minus 1 so the TMS value is equal to 0 0.275 into 0 0.05 divided by 0 0.14 which comes as 0 0.098 second so for uh, LV over current uh, relay the TMS can be chosen as 0 0.1 second or uh, 100 millisecond now I will calculate uh, the TMS for HP over current uh, relay here the current set is 110% uh, of uh, HB full load current and that is 110% of 175 ampere and tip time is considered as uh, 0.275 plus uh, 0 0.15 that is 150 millisecond margin is taken for tip time in the HB over current relay which is uh, 0.425 second. Mm. Now PSM is given by uh, IF by IS uh, which will be uh, same as uh, in case of LV over current uh, relay as the this ratio that is IF by IS uh, will be same as the, the IS, IF and IS is both reflected to the HB side only and that is why PSM as 10.69. Now uh, tip time is uh, 0 0.425 uh, is given by equal to 0 0.14 into TMS divided by PSM to the power 0 0.02 minus 1 which is equal to 0.14 to TMS 10 to the power 10.69 to the power 0 0.02 minus 1 so TMS comes as 0 0.425 into 0 0.05 divided by 0 0.14 comes as 0 0.15 uh, second so TMS for uh, HV over current relay is 0 0.15 one five second or one hundred fifty millisecond. So, uh, this in this video, uh, the how the HV and LV over current uh, relay setting is coordinated with the eleven kV feeder is uh, discussed. So, if you like my videos, then you can uh, mm, subscribe my channel and also press bell button for notification of videos to be uploaded in future. 
सो फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग माय वीडियोस